Hey guys, today we are standing in front of Longhorn Steakhouse. And the reason we are here is because what you get when you sign up for their e-club. And we will tell you about that once we get inside. I wanted to give a shout out to one of our subscribers, Greg. He went back to school to get his MBA. This past semester he got straight A's. Awesome job, Greg. Yeah, congratulations on that, Greg. And thank you for watching. So are you ready, Bobby? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. Well, here's what you get when you sign up for the E-Club, a free appetizer. And our favorite appetizer at all restaurants is probably here, the Wild West Shrimp. We're not going to pass up that. You can get any appetizer you want. This coupon's worth almost $12. I know they bring these coupons out to get you in the restaurant, but as you're going to see, this place has some reasonable prices at lunch. Let's take a look at Longhorn Steakhouse's lunch menu. Steakhouse drinks, ice cold beer, and signature cocktails. Epic beginnings. These are the appetizers that you can use the coupon on. Guys, get the Wild West shrimp. They have some wings, they have some chicken bites, firecracker chicken wraps. Here are the Steakhouse lunch plates. You can hardly go wrong with the value of any of these. There's a pick two, you get to pick either a salad, soup, or a side. Entree salads with house-made salad dressing. Their specialty, grilled chicken and strawberry salad. They have fresh greens, they have a Caesar salad, and a seven pepper sirloin salad. Legendary steaks. The top three are their specialties, and that's what probably what most people get. But it's lunch, I'm getting all that shrimp. I'm gonna get the renegade sirloin for $12.49. If you don't like steak, they have these options. Their chicken tenders are very good. They have salmon, grilled shrimp, and ribs. But the thing that sticks out here is this Parmesan crusted chicken. If you've never had it here, you need to get it. One piece, $12.99. Two pieces, $14.99. If you want to add a chopped salad, it's $1.49. Or a cup of soup for $2.99. And these meals come with one side. Sides, salads, and soups. You can upgrade for $2.79 to a signature side or a signature salad. The thing that sticks out on this side is right there, that shrimp and lobster chowder. You guys need to try that sometime. And for dessert, they give you four choices with the chocolate stampede and molten lava cake. They serve Coke products here, and they have flavored iced teas with raspberry or peach. They just brought us out some homemade wheat bread. How does that look? Well, I know it's going to be good because we always enjoy their bread, don't we? It's we do. One of the best places. Let's take a look at it. Oh. Looks pretty good. Might cut one more. Go. Crunchy on the outside and soft on the inside, as you can see. I think this is like a, a honey wheat bread, right? Yep, it's honey wheat. One more look at it. All right, Bobby, what did you think about the hot honey wheat bread here? I like it. Um, it's soft inside. And like I said, crunchy, as you can see when I was cutting it. But the butter is what I like. It's just regular butter. There's no sweetness or anything in it. You're not a huge fan of some of the sweetness, but you do yeah. like the Texas Roadhouse butter, if I yeah, remember I like right. Those, but if I had my choice, it would just be. Just regular butter. I'm gonna try this bread, like Bobby said, nice and crispy. That bread is so good. When you're eating it, you can taste the grains of wheat in it almost. I always like their bread. I do like sweet butter, but this is good on that. Just a little hint of sweetness in this. Always enjoy the bread here. I just noticed a couple of new items here on the table. They have a new Parmesan crusted spinach dip and the cheesecake, it says. I would like to try the spinach dip. I know you're not a fan of spinach dip when I make it at home. I know, I'm not a big fan of that, but 
you probably would like that as creamy Parmesan and garlic cheese crusts served with crispy flatbread chips. Yeah, because when I um, take spinach dip parties that I make, everybody always says you need to double or triple the recipe because there's never enough. John doesn't like it. He did try it. I did try, I did try it. That did was try. the main thing. And here's the cheesecake for $9.79. It's just a creamy cheesecake on a honey graham crust. Such a beautiful restaurant inside. I love the western theme in I do here. too. Now we're kind of in the back. There's more lighting back here because it's yeah. always kind of dark in here. Very pretty. And we have that lights directly above us. Everybody else just has those little, yeah. like little lamps on their tables. It just brought out our free e-club appetizer, the wild west shrimp that normally cost $11.79. It's their signature crispy hand-breaded shrimp tossed with spicy cherry peppers and garlic butter. Serve with ranch dip. Get the brain and iron! Whoa, you really like it, bro. Grab it, grab it. See on top of the lid. Guys, we're kicking over here. Here we go, fellas. Hold tight. Easy. Take it easy. Set him up. Go on, little fella. Get on out of here. Go on. Nice, boys. It's not the same old West at Longhorn Steakhouse. Try our batter fried Wild West shrimp tossed with garlic butter and cherry peppers. Longhorn Steakhouse, there's a new West in town. How does that look, Bobby? Those sweet and maybe little spicy cherry peppers in there. A little bit of that garlic butter with the breaded shrimp. It's a nice size appetizer, isn't it? And that could be a meal. I've come in here and gotten this as yeah, a meal add before. a salad or a soup. Does it give you a good bit of shrimp? So I'm gonna try one while they're still warm. All right. Something else about this shrimp, it has their famous prairie dust on it. You can see a little bit of on that one. What did you think? Well, as you can see, it's, it's coated, but it's kind of lightly coated. I mean, it's not overly coated where it's like a thick coating, so you can still taste the shrimp nice and hot. Uh, I don't taste a lot of garlic, but it's more a buttery flavor to me. Yeah, it's sauteed in butter. There's their ranch sauce. Try it. Well, since you dipped it in the ranch, you like it better in the ranch or by itself? The ranch is very good, but um, I think if you want more of the flavor of the uh, crust and the shrimp, do it without. But either way, I like it. This is our favorite appetizer. Yes. Now, their wings are amazing here also. Yeah, their wings are good, but this is one of our favorites. Plus, when you get, you know, we're going to get a chicken and a steak, we don't need probably any more like chicken wings or anything. You can't get a big meal when you get this if you for two and it's people. Lunch time. Mm -hmm. And another thing, guys, that was free. Didn't cost anything. That always makes it better. I'm gonna try it. We'll try it like Bobby did without anything. That hand breaded shrimp. Lightly breaded, like Bobby said. Just nice and crispy. You can see like you can tell there's butter on there the way it's glistening. I'm gonna try one of those peppers. You know what? I'm just gonna try one of those peppers with. See how spicy it is with this. That cherry pepper, it's about a medium spiciness to it. That really adds, kicks it up a notch. Eating it that way, I couldn't really taste the garlic on it, but I'm gonna try it one more time just to see by itself if I can taste the garlic on the shrimp. Still don't get a lot of flavor from the garlic on there, but that shrimp is so good. It's crispy, We've got a little bit of the spiciness on some of them with those peppers laying on them. I love the ranch. You want to come here sometime? We said it earlier. Get this as your meal. It's just mm -hmm. that good. At, you know, I took another shrimp while you were trying yours, and I did know notice a little bit more spice. Well, I think probably nothing bad, but just no. uh, probably where one of the peppers were. Yeah, and the peppers are like the medium spice, but that really adds to it. It does. A great appetizer, maybe one of the best appetizers of all the restaurant chain. All right, the food came, and it came pretty fast. There's my renegade sirloin look at the size of that baked potato that loaded baked potato with that salt on there and bobby's parmesan crusted chicken with uh what is that a sweet, sweet potato. potato brown sugar and butter now look how pretty the presentation is that chicken looks really nice doesn't it it does with all that cheese and parmesan and the crust on it now you added an extra piece of chicken for just two dollars more and tell us why you did that well, my mom's been in the hospital for about two weeks now, 
and we all know how hospital food is. So I thought she'd like this. So he's going to bring me a box and a plastic fork and knife, and we're going to take this to her after we get done eating. Well, let me tell you what's inside this Parmesan crusted chicken. We got grilled chicken breasts with creamy Parmesan and garlic cheese crust with the panko breadcrumbs. That is provolone cheese. And if you want to make this kind of at home, there's also buttermilk ranch in there. Maybe we'll try this one sometime. We ought to, because you know what? I know people come here for steaks and we come here for these appetizers, but this might be about the best thing mm -hmm. on the menu. Very good show. All right, Bobby, what are you going to try first? I'm going to try this sweet potato. Look how nice and soft it is. Baked well inside. Nice brown sugar and butter. Sweet potatoes are one of my favorite things. Well, what did you think of the sweet potato? Can't go wrong with the sweet potatoes here. It's a pretty nice size too, I think. Sweet potato, like I said, it was soft. Got your butter in it and plenty of brown sugar. And I know you like that, that that's on the menu. A lot of times you don't see sweet potatoes on the menu. Okay, I'm gonna separate that. That would be mom's and this one will be mine. Guys, while I'm filming this, I'm having to eat some of this shrimp. It just looks too good to just be sitting there like that. I know. <laughs> it's a bad thing about doing the food vlogs. We're sitting here with all this good food and we gotta stop and film one of us eating it. A piece of that cheese. Let's take a side look at this chicken. Look how good that is, guys, with those breadcrumbs on there and all that provolone cheese. What did you think about it? Very nice and tender piece of chicken. As you can see, those are two nice sized breasts for lunchtime. Um, the provolone cheese gives it a lot of flavor with the Parmesan, but it tastes like a, a buttery flavor almost, and I wonder if that's because of the ranch dressing that they use with it could be it's buttermilk it's kind of like a creamy flavor. yeah and it even looks creamy by looking at it but we highly recommend this if you yeah. guys have been to longhorn and only gotten steaks try this chicken yeah especially if you're not a fan this chicken is excellent all right guys here we go lunchtime just got the sirloin i know there's not as much fat in that that's more leaner than a ribeye or any of that but it's this prairie dust that they put on there that makes it so good look at this knife i could carve up a deer with that just cut it this way. It's got it medium. See how it looks on the side here. Might be a little, let's see. Well, there's some pink to it. Mm -hmm. So that's not too bad. Some people get it medium, probably like a little more pink in there, but it's not bad. One thing about sirloin, some people don't like it. They think it's too chewy. But let's just try it out. Think about your steaks here. No matter which one you get, they put that season on there. They all taste good. Let's go. That first bite with those spices in there, I thought was great. Let me show you the side cut from the center. So that is, that's medium. And that's where you like that's it. That's where I like it. I can eat it anyway. It doesn't matter to me if it looks like that. Or some, some people say it's well done. I don't get steak all the time. It's flavorful. It's juicy. You can see that, how juicy it is. So that's a good steak for $12.49 with this monstrous baked potato. I'm happy with that. If I wanted a better flavorful steak, I would've got the filet or the ribeye. Look at the size of that baked potato. I like to put that sea salt on the outside. Got the sour cream in there. Got some chives. Uh, everything. Butter, cheese. Yeah, so let's just mix it up a little bit. Get this nice, pretty good size. Baked potato is done like it should be. It's nice and soft. You see the fork goes right through it. I like all the stuff they put on it. Now, I eat the skin on this stuff. I don't know if you guys do, but I do, and that's why I like that salt on there. Sometimes I even put more salt on it. And before I forget, I always tell you a little bit of info about the place we're at. Longhorn started in 1981 in Atlanta, Georgia, and there are 579 of these in the United States. So hopefully all you guys have one of these around. A lot of people think too that Longhorn is really pricey. I don't think they're that bad, and especially at lunch, if you saw that lunch menu. $12.49 for this, guys. You can't go wrong with that. And what Bobby got, highly recommend this place again for lunch. The more I eat of this steak, the more I like it. You can see the it's medium in there, and it's not real chewy. That's something about a sirloin, a lot of people don't like they're too chewy. This one is not.
Enjoy the bold taste of the American West. Head on over to Longhorn Steakhouse, where we serve only the premium cuts, so you can savor the most perfectly grilled legendary steaks in town. We guarantee a cut above experience, because at Longhorn, we know you can't fake steak. Longhorn. I'm gonna try some of this Parmesan crusted chicken because it's one of my favorite things on the menu. First thing I noticed about that, that is just melt in your mouth. You don't even have to chew it, it is just that soft. A little bit of garlic, the creaminess of that buttermilk ranch in there with the crumbs, crunchiness of it. That might be some of the best chicken that you're gonna find anywhere in any restaurant. Here is our receipt for lunch here at Longhorn. Got the shrimp, used the coupon, it came off there, so it was free. The sirloin, $12.49. Bobby's Parmesan chicken, $14.99. Grand total, $29.13. And you cannot beat that for all that food. Well, we hope you guys enjoyed our trip to Longhorn today and giving you a heads up on why you should sign up for the E-Club. What did you think of yours, Bobby? First, I want to give a shout out to Nick, our waiter. He did an excellent job. This is one of the busier restaurants where we live. So he was very busy today when they joined. Oh, he had several tables, but he still took time to come by our table to check on us to see if we needed anything. So thank you for that, Nick. Um, there's two nice big pieces of chicken and that big sweet potato for $15. You can't beat that uh, with the Parmesan cheese on it and the provolone and then when I cut into it you could see that buttermilk dressing on there could you see that when yeah we should have filmed middle, that yeah after I cut to the middle of the chicken I was like oh we should have did it this way but instead of taking it off the end but with all that buttermilk there. ranch yeah with all <laughs> yeah, that buttermilk just ranch just come out of it it was very good the chicken's nice and tender um and that appetizer we got the shrimp oh. that's one of our favorites so that coupon that we had I mean that was free that was a really good deal so we want to hurry up and finish this uh, review up because we want to get that chicken over to mom. Yeah, so my meal, the main reason we came here today, well, not the main reason, is we love coming to Longhorn, but was to get that free appetizer because we have come here before and just ate that. You can split that almost mm -hmm. between two yeah, people. Yeah, like we said inside, sometimes we'd get a soup or a mm -hmm. salad with the shrimp. That is just so good. And got a sirloin today because it is lunch. I know that's not what a lot of you guys would get. You'd get the bigger steaks here. But it was a good sirloin. Had that big baked potato in there. Their prairie dust spice on there. So for $12.49 with that bread, you cannot go wrong with that meal. We love that bread. We do. That bread is so good. So, guys, what you need to do, go to Longhorn's website. Sign up for their e-club. They're going to send you this coupon came because that must have signed up last year. It's like on a year anniversary when you sign up, they will send you that free appetizer. But I'm thinking you get one of those on your birthday. They send you other ones throughout the year. And if you go to Longhorn much, it's definitely worth it because the coupons are like $11 and something. Mm -hmm. Another thing good to get on the appetizer, those Bobbies, the chicken wings. Yeah, we've tried those before. Great but chicken wings. Inside, it's just a beautiful restaurant, isn't it? The atmosphere mm -hmm. of the, the cowboy boots and everything. Very clean restaurant, too. And like Bobby said, this might be one of the most popular places here in town. I know when it first came to town, people thought it was expensive. Mm -hmm. But we showed you that lunch menu. Now, the stuff we got, you can get at dinner time, but they have like those chicken sandwiches for $9 and the soup and salad. We're going to come back here sometime and just get one of those items, or both of us get one, and show you what you get for that, because that is hard to beat. Mm -hmm. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Yeah, so until we meet again, J&B have, have left, left the, the building. building.